this is a strange place to meet someone, isn't it? Hey there, cool cats, and welcome to Grim Tales The Vengeance. Alright, so this is the sixth game in the Grim Tales series. Yes, you heard that correctly, the sixth, because I actually played the fifth game, Bloody Mary, a long time ago. In fact, a few years ago. Um, I'll leave the link in the description below if you want to check that out. Um, because that was before I, I, I even knew that the Grim Tales actually had a series by itself. I just thought it was the name of the game. Uh, but yeah, anyway, so we are still continuing with the Grey Family Saga, I assume. Um, I don't know what the games are about because I just looked up the titles and basically like just make sure that the I'm playing them in order this time. But I'm just gonna guess that we're still trying to save Louise's family because I can't escape the curse that is my bloodline, unfortunately. So anyway, let's go. I'm playing as casual as always. Let's see what we have in store. Aunt Gray, it's me, your nephew, James. It's Elizabeth. She's gone and... This is so hard. They think I killed her. Aunt Grey, you know me. I wouldn't do this. Please, I need your help. James! Wait, hold on. Oh, no, I don't want interactive help. James! Okay, uh, here's the thing. So in Bloody Mary, no, sorry, in the last game, we know that our sister had a son. His name was Brandon. And he went off to marry the Stone Queen, I assume. And in Bloody Mary, which is the game that immediately follows that, we had to save our niece named Jackie. And then now I'm hearing that we have more nephews and nieces. Now one named James and another one named Elizabeth. I... <laughs> Louisa, can you just stop procreating? <laughs> you need... I need a. S I don't need to save any more family members. Come on, sis, sis, please. Ugh. Oh, do we have our journal back? No, we do not. It's just a map. Oh wait, we do. Do we have a diary? <gasps> we have our journal back! Oh my god, guys, guys, this is huge. This is big news. This is big news because I've. I keep saying that I kind of miss the scrapbook journal concept from the games, and the last few games didn't have it. So I'm kind of glad we got this, so now I can read some stuff. Uh, hopefully it will be helpful for the game. If it's not helpful, then it's just, you know, nice exposition, extra stuff for the game. My peaceful evening was shattered by horrible news. Our family has been hit with a double misfortune. My niece, Elizabeth McGray, was killed, and her brother James accused us, accused of murder. My god. Oh, I also I didn't know that there was a mech at the front of the gray. I always thought it was just gray, but I don't know. Interesting. We have a bunch of collectibles, apparently. Statues. Statuettes. And achievements. Okay. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna play these games for the achievements, but uh nice to know. Hover over the bottom of the screen to open the inventory. Create a lockpick from the paperclip. Oh, this is this is some extra stuff we didn't get before. That's cool. Nice. Wow. I got skills to pay the bills. What did this say again? Today is the hearing of the case over the murder of an Elizabeth McGray. The defendant is James McGray, the brother of the victim. Miss Gray, the aunt of the McGray siblings, should take part in the hearing. Why? Why specifically me? Why... Where is their where are their parents? I still can't believe this happened to my family. Really? 
After all you've been through? After all the adventures we've been since game one? And you still can't believe this is happening? Sis, please, come on. Ooh, hello kitty! So we got like some clickables and lots of nice interaction. Uh, let me just talk about the art of this game, it's really nice. Um, I don't know whether it's an upgrade or a downgrade from the last game, but it's it's nice. It's eye-catching, I love the colors. Now, I'm no expert whatsoever, but uh, I just I just say what I see, man. I just say what I see. How will I get my suitcase open? By lockpicking it, of course. Yes. Ooh, detective's license. So I am a detective. I, I this wasn't confirmed, and I said this before. Like I had no idea what what I did for a living, but it turns out I am in fact a detective, which is cool. I have. I'll need to present my subpoena as a form of identification. All right, cool. I did not get to read what that said. I clicked too fast. Sorry. I don't know what I'd do if I couldn't get it open. He won't let me in without my subpoena. I guess. Who is this? Is this Brandon or is this James? I guess it's Brand. I guess it's James. We've always been close. I didn't hesitate when James asked me to help. Okay, that's more that I did for my sister. I have no time to make a call. I need to get inside before the trial starts. Oh, okay. Hello, Entrance sir. Entrance into the courtroom is restricted to participants in the trial. You have a subpoena? Yes, I do. Here we go. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, I should have recognized you at once, Miss Gray. I'm honored to meet you. This must be so hard for you, losing your knees and now her brother's accused of the murder. They say people will do anything for a fortune, but this? My heart goes out to you. Here we are. Please, come in. Aw, thank you. You're so sweet and kind. Also, thank you for recognizing my... my brilliance. Is James guilty of his sister, Elizabeth's murder? Who knows? Ms. Gray. Your reputation precedes you. Your ability to pick up the memories of key objects will serve us well in this case. Why is there a talking corpse? Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't introduce myself. I'm Judge Adderley, and this is Mr. Kendrick, the prosecuting counsel. This is Mr. Johnson, counsel for the defense. Okay, nice to meet you all. As you know, your nephew James has been charged with the murder of his sister Elizabeth. He pleads not guilty. Your role is not to judge the case, but to provide us with insight. Mm hey, okay. We've collected physical evidence for you to peruse. Use whatever best gives you connection to the case. All right. Do these people know about my superhuman ability to like go into the past and time travel and all that stuff? Because that would be pretty helpful to the case. All right. Perhaps I'll find clues in the past, then I can determine which pieces of evidence to show in the court. Oh, okay. So I do need to click. Oh, right. Hidden object game. Let's go! I guess they do know about my ability. Or something. I'm getting the strongest vibe from this photo of Blackrock Castle. Okay, let's go. I'm going in a trance. I see something. I see a vision. Ooh, nice. And I'm back in the past. This must be when Elizabeth was still alive. As usual, time is standing still when I'm here. Kitty! So cute. Hello. The swan. The stone is loose. I just need something sturdy to pry it up. Alright. I don't need to go this way right now. Okay. Here's the swan missing. Ooh. What's this? A crystal. And a saw! Very useful. I have to clean off the webs before taking a look. Okay. Need something to clean. I guess I can saw this. Let me in! Ooh, brush. Clover. I wonder if anyone still uses this hiding place. I'm sure they do. Ooh, lots of stuff. Thank you. Let me clean this place first. Ah, okay. Missing a valve. Right. 
I think that's about all we can do. Let me just check my journal. Do I see anything in here? Hmm. A photo of the family castle I found among the evidence helped me enter Elizabeth's memories. Now I can start looking for real evidence that will clear up this situation. So I'm kind of like, I guess, I guess they know me as a clairvoyant detective, I guess. If not, they wouldn't have, you know, entertained me. Oh, what's this now? This looks familiar. Hmm. Like mother, like daughter, I guess. Cue the dramatic music. What would cause such a fight between them? Unfortunately, I can't ask them myself. I, I guess this is James? Supposedly? That would make him a big suspect. They're frozen to the bucket. Okay. Ooh, what's this? Oh. Hello? If one of the heirs should die, the entire estate shall be awarded to the surviving heir without delay. It wasn't long before James and I found our parents' legacy plans. I was first in line to inherit, with James after me. I can't say whether or not it was fair, but it was my parents' wishes. Oh, interesting. Okay, so we got some new mechanics here, unlike the other games. This is a list of clues you must discover. Press the projector button to watch a video about each clue you find. Select an item to learn more about it. Okay. Find four more clues to complete this stage of your investigation. Okay. How do, how do I see it again? Hello? Oh, I want I want to check out the items again. Oh, okay, never mind. The handle has fallen off the small chest. Okay. Oh, the statue. These are statuettes hidden in some. Oh, there are statuettes hidden in some locations. To see what you have found so far, press the pop-up window, which appears after you find a statuette. You can also open the map and press the collectibles button. Bottle is corked tight. Ah, there's something in the bushes. There's something among the roses, but I don't want to cut my hand on those sharp thorns. Okay. I also love the fact that the dog is here in the memory. Okay, kettle's too hot to touch. And there's something leaking. Oil. Could be useful if I had something to collect it in. Okay. Huh, this is the first. I need a lock to unlock it. Some parts are missing from the statuette. Ah, we need another lion, I suppose. And I can't open it with this while the zipper pull is missing. Okay. Lots of things are missing. Doesn't James keep the key for this door somewhere? I can't remember exactly where. Well, how am I supposed to know that? Judging by the rest, no one has used this door in years. Okay, maybe it's a family vault or something. Boop. Ah, a star key? Yep, star key. Okay. Well, we have a valve, so. You've gone too far. You must be stopped. The... The hell? What was that? There shouldn't be anything moving here. Time should be stopped. I would know this. I'm an expert. Okay, you got water. What's that? A red stone. Well, it kind of looks like a flower. Can I collect some water here? Thank you. Uh, is there anything else in the closet? Nope, it's clover. Okay, clover. Crystal... well, nothing else useful. Who knew a one bucket of water could be so powerful? Anyway. Ooh, a zipper pull. Okay, we need that, and we need this. Wow. Oh my, how elaborate. Okay, read the instructions, always. Reconstruct the stained glass window, drag and drop the pieces into the frame. Pieces do not need to be rotated. Thank God you told me, otherwise I would have been stuck doing that. 
Okay, so yeah, hmm, interesting, interesting. Mm -hmm. Okay, we have a little bit of a clue here. I think it's supposed to be a picture of Elizabeth. Yes. Hello? It looks like nothing has changed. So, put this first. Let's see what's in here. A key. And half a scissors. Am I supposed to be able to do something? Or maybe not. Have to find the other half first. A silver key. A silver key, eh? Hmm. Oh, wait. We got a star key the other... just now. Ooh. What's that? Wolf Domino. And a broken ruler. Okay. Ruler is bro broken, but doesn't mean I can't fix it. Okay, well. Maybe not right now. Maybe I need to find some tape. Anyway, we got a key. Let's see if it fits here. Yes, it does. Bye! Hello? Okay. Oh! Alright, calm down. <laughs> I know I saw someone, but that's impossible! Time is frozen here, which means no one should be moving. Hmm, interesting. If I had something thin, I could unlock the hatch. I'm pretty sure my hand can fit through that. You know, I don't, I don't think my hands are that pudgy. James, I'll need a tool to remove these bolts. I got tape. All right. Let's see if I can do this now. Wrench. Very handy. I saw something that needed a bolt. Eh, here it is. Oh, a whistle? James has loved dogs ever since he was a little boy. But I was always afraid of them. We're so different sometimes. It's hard to believe we're brother and sister. James learned to use a dog whistle, and his dogs obeyed him well. There was a young girl who used to laugh when he used his command voice. What? There was a girl who used to laugh when he used his command voice? Ah. Okay. All right. Well, there's steam coming out of there, so I'm gonna need to patch that up. Oh, I probably won't read everything in the journal, so I'll just leave it open for you to read um, at your own time, so. Okay, so very odd that the uh, memory actually mentioned a girl, so I have a feeling this person kind of... Uh, Framed, James. Silver my great son, Austin, was infamous for his short temper. He once tried to hit a mate for spilling his cup of tea. Oh boy. Trophy. Don't have that. Clock. I need something else to start the mechanism. Like what? A pendulum. Okay, maybe. What's this? A crown. The amulet is broken. I need to fix it. Oh. Is there supposed to be like another half that goes on top? 
maybe. And we're missing a moon and sun symbol. Okay, so a couple of things to do already. Oh, okay. Use the scissors. I didn't think I would was supposed to use the scissors. I thought I'd just like find a glove or something, but okay, that works too. Cork? Cork. Cork. Cork! Cork. Boop. Yep. Gotcha. Okay, bear domino. Hmm, interesting. Is there anything else? Huh. Okay, do I still have the scissors? Someone has sewn up the edge of the carpet. Is there something underneath here? Yep. Cool. Alright, so we got the pendulum. Nice. Gotcha. Is there anything here? Okay, it still needs something. So maybe this... Is this... I, I can't tell if that's like a drawing on the clock or if that's actually like a, a figurine. Maybe it's a drawing. Mmm, what was that? The neck of the bottle is too narrow for my- How big is your hand, honey? Okay, the antler is screwed down, can't pull it out of the holder. Milk jug. Can I go back and get water and then just fill this thing up with water? I don't need a bucket full. Oh. Ah, I'm supposed to get oil. Forgot about that. Something was rusted. This thing. I'm so dainty when it comes to the oil. Oh. Guess we gotta play dominoes. Place all the dominoes end to end so they form a figure 8. Dominoes must match images where they touch and the glowing animals. Hmm. Form a figure 8. Oh wait, you're supposed to put them here, I see. Okay, well... Oh, wow. I actually figured that out. Damn. Hello? Nice try. Didn't get me that time. Anyway, I thought that bear was attacking me. I was just seeing things, I suppose. Well, not the weirdest thing, I suppose. Austin McGree's son, Arthur, was a well-known hunter. Oh, on one outing, he accidentally shot his huntsman, who later died. What the fuck is wrong with this family? No gunpowder in this bullet. Ah, oh, I see. The vice won't work without a handle. Okay. Clamps is stuck. I have to cut the belt. Oh crap! I don't. I don't have my scissors. Why did? Why do I always throw the useful things away? Lock is really strong. I have to destroy it to open it. Okay. Do I have to like shoot it? Maybe. It's got a target on it. That looks like a handle. A knife grip. Gun is empty, which means there aren't many ways I can use it. Ah, the poor deer is missing one of its antlers. Okay. Okay, that's about it. I'm not getting- I'm not going anywhere near that bear. Uh, oh, what's that? Morphing objects? There were morphing objects? Hang on, I didn't know that. Hang on, I wanna- I wanna come back. Ooh, okay, okay. Wait, 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 wait. Was there something out here as well? I never saw. Sorry guys, taking a little detour here, but uh, 
Ah, this is kind of cool. Okay. I hope there's only like one morphing object in each room, because otherwise I doubt I'm I'm gonna find all of them. Okay, so we got a grip. So first of all, got that knife. Okay, so can I cut the strap with the knife? Please say yes. Yes, thank you. I can't take the cork out, it's stuck. What cork? There's a cork? Oh, okay. Uh, I'll get- I guess I need a corkscrew? I guess that's about it. Okay. I still need a corkscrew. Metallic feather. And an oven mitt. Ah, I guess that's what we need for the uh, kettle. That's still on the fire. Oh my. What is behind the secret door in the trophy room? Who knows? One of the figurines is missing. Okay. Hmm. A stick. Very useful. Oh wait, it is. Wait, hold on. Can I use a stick for this? Let's see. No, come on. Knife. Ah, it's for the knife. Okay. Ooh. Two emblems are missing from this wreathed crown. I don't know why I had such trouble reading it. Okay, so find another angel for that. Let's get the uh, water or kettle. Fire would be useful, I just need a way to carry it. Okay, I'm guessing I'm gonna need a torch. Water, water. Can I pour water in this? No. Okay, fine. Oh, wait! Pliers. I have pliers. Can I use this? No. Come on! Fine. I guess I need the tongs for that, maybe. Oh, I see. What is this? A powder flask. So, can I... Oh. So now I have a bullet. Alright. I take this weapon and I vow to use it to protect my land from anyone who dares attack it. Alright. Give me another memory. I'm sure James will never forget the day Father gave him his daughter. My brother was never happier. James vowed to always protect our family. It's an old fashioned sentiment, but my family values Sorry, what was that, Elizabeth? You got cut off there. Okay, the sign behind the gun shows that James vowed to protect his family. I believe that he meant it. Just want to check the valuables. The ancestor of the McGray family was obsessed with money and gained his wealth by fraud and deception. Okay. Damn. <laughs> nice. Okay, we got the first half. Now we just need the moon. Oh, hang on. We have hot water. And it was frozen. I get it. I get it. I was this close to like using a hint. Okay, we got tongs. Is the tongs used for this? Yes. Just notice that's the fanciest pair of tongs I've ever seen. I think we got a handle. Okay, shell handle. This was for this. Yes! Corkscrew! Fantastic. We needed this for this. And we got the moon! Yay! Okay. Let's go. Elizabeth's bedroom. Hello? You better leave this place. While you still 
I'm sorry, did you just throw a butter knife at me? <sighs> Is it the ghost again? It seems like ghosts can travel here. Apparently so. Well, you've dealt with ghosts before, so this shouldn't be too bad. You need a special emblem to open the diary. Oh, okay. I think this must be the emblem for that. That's cool. Martha Maxwell. Oh, cool. When you find all statuettes of a row, part of the story is revealed. To see the collection, press the pop-up window. You can also open the map and press the collectibles button there. Cool. Silver McGray's daughter, Martha, was forced to marry against her will and didn't love her husband. Aww. She never got on well with her mother-in-law and lived in constant anxiety. After a particularly heated argument, she had a heart attack. Oh my god, that's so sad. Press this gem to watch your unlocked video. Cool. Both the McGrays and Maxwells descended f from the from from the from. Okay. From the same ancestor, Silver McGray. By the end of his life, Silver had managed to gather considerable wealth, though many suspected it was achieved through foul play. Why am I not surprised? Daughter Martha married into the Maxwells, while his son Arthur continued the direct family line. Two siblings always got along well. Maxwells even moved close to Black Rock Castle. I don't know if this is important to the main story, but it's, you know, because it's optional, so it might not. Hartley arguments between families, splitting property was uncharacteristic of the McGrays, even though they took excellent care of their finances. One of the few good traits inherited from the Silver McGray. Um, kind of opposite of what the picture is showing, but okay. Rich people problems, am I right? Yeah, can't relate. Ah. Ooh. Ooh, nice. What is this? Sort all of the mismatched accessories by returning them to the correct dolls. Dolls may only hold one accessory at a time. Okay, thank god. Ooh, what's this? Balloon? Oh, okay. Crown. Oh, crown princess. Oh, I see. Wait, that kind of sucks though, because that implies that the woman is the accessory to the man. <laughs> okay, I'm, I'm not going to say anything else, but yeah. There's definitely something under the bed, but it's too dark to see what it is. Okay. I can't find the morphing object here, and I'm sad. What's this? Wind-up key. Okay. Don't have time to look for another key, but the lock looks simple enough to pick. Oh, well. Too bad I got rid of my lockpick, huh? Can I use this? The edges of the dome are damaged. I have no other way but to break it. Well, I don't have anything to do that. What's this? Looks like someone was attached on top. Okay, looks like this lady is missing her hat. The chest should open if I find what belongs in the slot. Okay, so there's a lot of missing stuff here. Well, we do have a prince. But we don't have a horse. Okay. Also, so something. Okay, I can't. I can't do that yet. I guess. Hmm. Hmm. Was there something else that needed a corkscrew? I can't remember. Gotcha. <laughs> nice. All right. We can, we can continue now. Okay. I'm kind of stuck, so I'm just gonna use a hint and see what happens. Okay. Corridor. Okay, what's here? Oh, a wind-up key! 
I see. That's what I needed. Oh, okay. So I thought I needed to find a horse. Ah. So I take the ballerina. Ah, I see. Was the ballerina missing here? Aha! The second angel! That goes here. A tuning fork. What do I use a tuning fork for? Hmm. Ah, there was glass that I needed to break. I'm not really sure how accurate this is because I've seen it done a lot of times in games, but I don't know whether that's accurate or not. Duh. You know what? I shouldn't complain. Yes. Okay, this hat goes here. Don't call me that ever again. Silver heart. Okay. Is the silver heart here? Ah. I see. That seems to go here, I guess. Wow. Cool. It's a pity the note is torn. I should place all the pieces together. Okay. Not much of a puzzle, but I will accept it. Dear Elizabeth, I believe something evil is happening inside our home, but don't be scared. I will protect you. No matter what happens, I won't let any danger befall you. Love, James. Why was this torn up, though? My dear brother always loved the music. He made me feel like he was the older sibling whenever he brought me gifts. As if I were his little sister. That could be taken both negatively and positively because it's like as if, you know, haha, I don't accept your authority as the older sibling, so I'm going to treat you as a younger sibling. But who knows, that's just me. Drop it!